According to Job Amupanda, the Sobo Party Youthly Constitution states that all Central Committee members are to attend all meetings. His presence at one of those meetings caused confusion and division up to the point where some of the members were involved in a physical fight. The tempers got high and uh, people wanted to confront each other and at one point some of them stood up wanting to moor each other, calling each other to go outside and it was a very ugly scene really and uh, the meeting adjourned for five minutes. After five minutes we came back again, the debate continued and those that were presiding over the meeting felt that this meeting won't go anywhere, this issue must be clarified elsewhere. Amopanda says that the Youth League has been excluding him from Central Committee activities for some time. Last month, he wrote a letter to the leadership of the Youth League, warning that there will be repercussions if they continue to ignore his position on the committee. Since we were reinstated, um, since the suspension and expulsion had been set aside, there's been no Central Committee. You would remember that I was elected number one to the Central Committee by the young people um, who are members of the Swapo Party Youth League. And the Congress. So, in terms of the constitution of the Youth League, the membership of the Central Committee is determined by Congress. It is Congress that says that you are a member, uh, you are not a member. And um, there has been no Congress. Um. We arrived at the Swapo headquarters to get a comment from the Swapo Party Youth League Acting Secretary Veiko Nekundi, who chaired the meeting. The two legal teams. Uh, engaging, engaging each other on the interpretation of the court order in relation to whether is or is not. So that is the context in which this meeting has preceded. And uh, I have then allowed the meeting to discuss uh, on the matter in context of what I just said, whether it is or it is not. And uh, following the deliberations by the meeting, uh, the chairperson then fulfilled that it is unwise while the, there are legal engagements between the, between the parties, the two parties' uh, legal teams, that it is just the right thing to do to adjourn the meeting uh, until such time that this matter, that legal content, is uh, finally uh, agreed by both parties, or at this such time that the party officially uh, give us a direction. Nekuli says that the party does not allow for misconduct among its youth and that those that were involved have already apologized to the party structure. He says the party is embarrassed, but he will not take further steps unless the National Executive Committee decides otherwise. For News Flash, I'm Joseph Shifene.